Hey guys, and welcome to another video. Today I am here with the Doge bracelet with beads this time. And I showed it previously in a video. Ones with C clips or no clips, just plain old bracelet. <laughs> and yeah, here's the video with the instructions on how to add beads. It's not that much different. If you've made the other one, this should be pretty darn easy. And yeah, these are paper beads that I actually made myself. And I'll link a video in the description so you can make your own. They're pretty easy, I'd say. But anyways, let's get started. So I use about four colors for this. Some beads in the middle. Well, four main colors for the center colors. One color for the border. One clip. You need two clips to help you work through the bracelet that you won't actually end up using at the end. But anyways, let's get started. So first off, you're going to start by threading all your beads onto bands, like this. And the way that you go about doing this is what I did, is you need a band to thread on, a bead, and a piece of wire just any little thin piece of wire. And what you're going to do is you're just going to place the band on the wire like this. And then you just take your bead, thread it onto both pieces of the wire. And pull it onto that band. And try not to tug on the wire that much, just mainly tug on the band once a piece of the band is available to be tugged on because you don't want to break your wire. But just pull on it, make sure each loop at the end is about of equal size, and then you can take your wire off. And there we go. So I already pre-threaded all my other bands, so I don't have to pause the video or anything right now. But now you can start your bracelet. So to start off your bracelet, you're going to take your border colors, just going to take one of them, twist it in a figure eight shape on your hook, and then pull another border band through that. And make sure you put those two bands that you pulled through back on your hook as well. So now you have four bands on your hook, or four halves of bands. <laughs> and next. You're going to do your standard fishtailing method and thread four bands onto these two bands. Pull one through, pick up the outer band, pull one through the first two, pick up the outer band, pull one through the first two, pick up the outer band, pull one through the first two, and pick up the outer band. Now you can flip your bracelet around. And do the same on the other side, again with four bands. One. Two. Three. And four. And now, you're going to start adding on your colors. So first, you're going to take a beaded band, and you're going to pull it through these center two whites. So just pinch these first bands here. Just make sure they don't fall off or unravel or anything. In fact, you might just want to pull a band through them to make it easier. I'm just going to pull a random band through. But be sure to leave the center two bands behind. But anyways, let me clip this. Alright, now you pull a band through the center two white bands. And pick up those white bands again, as well as the other end of the blue you just pulled through with the bead. 
you can put your closest white back on as well. Pull your next color through these first three. A white, your blue, and then another white. And then pick up your blue and the outermost white. Put your next white on. Pull your next color through, which I'm using pink for. Pull it through these four bands here instead of three. Pick up the outer two, white and purple. And then you put your next white on. And this time, instead of another colored center band, you're just going to pull white through. Pull this white through these first four and pick up the outer two. And then pull the white through these first three here. Pick up the outer one. And now you're going to put these two remaining bands back on your hook. Now you can unclip this, by the way. What you're going to do is you're going to uncross both pairs of these. So you'll see this one band here is crossed over the other. Right now you just uncross that. And same with the one here too. Now you're just going to pull this band here over these two and drop it off. And again, pull this band here over these two and drop it off. Now make sure these bands aren't crossed and then you can clip them. Now you flip your bracelet over. And then you can do this on the other side. So now you're just going to thread on your purple. I'm just going to pinch these now since there are less of them. Pull this purple through these three bands here. Pick up the outer two. Sorry, random technical difficulties. <laughs> Alright, then you take your next color, pull it through these first four bands here. Pick up the outer two. And then pull your whites through. Pull the white through these first four bands. Pick up the outer two. Then pull your white through these first three. Pick up the outer one. And then you're going to uncross your bands. And then pull this band over your first two and drop it off. Pull this band over and then you can drop it off. And then clip these first two bands here. And 
And now you can add on your next beaded band. I'm going to show you this step one more time and then I'm going to go off camera to do the rest. But the second time is a little bit different. It's the time, it's the type that you'll be doing for the rest of your bracelet. I'm going to drop these off. Make sure they don't unravel though. I don't feel like I need to pinch them so I don't. But you can thread a band through them or pinch them or do whatever if you feel more comfortable that way. Pull this band through the center two purple bands and pick them back up as well as that blue. And then you can place your pink on and pull the purple through. Pull it through these first three bands. Pick up the outer two, the blue and the pink. Center color and the outermost color basically. And then you place this white back on. Pull the pink through it. Through the first four bands. And then pick up the outer two. Put this white on. Make sure your C-clip doesn't drop anything or like pull through anything or anything weird like that. And then pull white through these first four. Pick up the outer two. And then pull the white through the first three. Pick up the outer one. And then put these two whites back on your hook. Uncross these two whites here. And then pull this over the first two and drop it off. And then pull this over the first two and drop it off. Then you can clip them. And then you flip your bracelet over and repeat the same thing on the other side. Pull the purple band through these first three. Pick up the outer two. Pull your pink through the first four. Pick up the outer two. Pull through a white through the first four. Pick up the outer two and then pull a white through the first three and pick up the outer one. Uncross these two whites here. Put these two whites back on. Pull white through these first two, drop them off, pull white through these first two, and drop it off. And then clip these first two whites. And then you just repeat that step, that row that I just showed you, until your bracelet's long enough to fit around your wrist, and then I'll come back to show you how to finish it up. 
Okay, so I'm back. I've made this long enough to fit around my wrist. And to finish it up, all I have to do is pull one of these clipped things back on my hook and unclip it. Now, you cross this end closest to the hook over this band here. And then, you take another white band, pull it through these first three whites, pick up the outer white, pull another white through, pull it through the first four bands, pick up the outer white, pull white through these first four bands, pick up the outer white, pull white through these first four bands again, and pick up the outer white. Now you flip your bracelet around, and do the same exact thing on the other side. Again, you just put these whites back on your hook and unclip them. Pull the left one over the right one. And then take your four whites and fishtail them on like I did previously. Pull your first one through the first three and pick up the outer white. Then through the first four. First four again. And first four. And then to finish it up, all you do is you just pull a white through these bands here. Take your clip and clip them. Then find the other end of your bracelet and clip the cap band at the other end. And there's your bracelet. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.